hey guys welcome back to the channel if you're new to this channel my name is Shelly and for today's video I'm gonna be cleaning my bathrooms changing the shower curtains and putting new bath mats and also I'll be throwing in a little Christmas decoration to you know put the little Christmas spirit in so guys I started out with the sink and what I'm using here is some 409 um, all-purpose cleaner and then I'll be moving on to the toilet and then the bathtub so sit back relax and you know enjoy the video So guys, what I'm using to wash these built-in shower is dishwashing liquid. I just use that for the walls and then I'll spray like some Clorox in the bathtub before I scrub it. So this is what I'm doing here. So guys, now that I'm done with the bathtub and the wall, I'm going to be hanging my shower curtain. Now, this shower curtain is not brand new. I used this last year Christmas and I am reusing it because no need to go out and buy a new shower curtain when Christmas is just a one day situation, guys. So guys these shower curtain hooks 
didn't come with this shower curtain. It's for another shower curtain that has red in it, but I chose to use it with this one just because I told you guys that I'm gonna be putting a little red in the bathroom. So guys, please ignore the mess in my background. It's my bedroom and I'm gonna clean it, but did not get to that part yet. And also this shine pan that I just showed you, I purchased this at TJ Maxx. And when I saw it, I say, what can I do with this container? And when I came home with it, I say, yes, I have the perfect thing. I'm gonna just roll some towels with different colors and just stuff them in and there you go bam my nice little decor what i'm doing here now guys is removing the white flowers and replacing it with red just to you know put a little pop of red in so guys i bought three pieces of this mat in TJ Maxx since October. I was just so in love with them when I saw them. I love the way they had the snowflakes and everything in it and I say, you know what, I'm not leaving these because when it comes closer to Christmas, I will not be finding these. So gladly I got them and now I'm gonna make use of them. So I have three pieces of mats. I have two round ones and one big square piece. So the square piece, I'm gonna use it right in front of the bathtub and the other two I'll put in front of each um, sink. So you might see me moving um, stuff around guys because I really don't even know if I like um, that thing on the windowsill but I might leave it there for now or you may see me moving it to another area. I just want everything to look right. This is a hand soap that I just showed you. I had it since last year. I'm plugging my Alexa back in. Guys, I don't know about you all, but nothing like taking your shower or your bath and listening to some nice music, right? So guys, George bought this shower bar to, you know, change out the other one that we have in the bathroom currently. But because of the type of built-in shower that we have, we don't want to damage the, the, the wall. So I think he's gonna get somebody professional to, to change it for us. So guys, so you like my little dash of red so far. Just that this little vase on the, on the sink and then the, these flowers, red flowers on the windowsill. All right, I'm doing my final little touch up because I'm about to move over to the second bathroom. So guys, this is what I did so far. Comment down below and let me know if you like it or what I should add or take away. So 
what do you all like everything so far comment down below and let me know how i did i think i did great i pat myself on my shoulder and also look at my mats i'm obsessed now i'm on to the second bathroom so you see what i'm doing here guys i'm just removing the old shower curtain and i'm gonna be cleaning i'm repeating everything that i did in the first bathroom so just sit back relax and enjoy the music
So guys, this shower curtain is a brand new one. It's not a Christmas shower curtain because I don't want to put one up that I have to change after Christmas. So you're going to see the one that I have. It's just a regular shower curtain. So, how do you all like my nice little floral shower curtain so far? I love it. And guess the good thing about it? After Christmas, when everybody is removing Christmas shower curtains and all that, I do not have to do a thing to this. This is going to stay up until I decide to change it. So guys, I know the red towels don't really go with this because it's more like a, a rose pink, but I'm just working with what I have right now. I'm not going to spend any extra money just to get towels. Right now, guys, I'm just going to put my final little touches, cleaning up the mirror, wiping off the sink again. I already did. I don't even know why I'm doing this again. And then I'm going to take a few videos and move on to the bathroom on the first floor. Guys, I'm so sorry about the angle of this bathroom. I can't find a good place to put the camera so you guys could see properly but I am trying my best so bear with me. So guys, I'll be taking these old mirrors off the wall. I've had them for a while. I moved with them from the old house and I have some gold stars that I want to hang on this wall just to give this area a different look.
so we are officially done with all three bathrooms and we're gonna go on the road monique is here so you'll be seeing me and her outside so guys remember in our old video we said the christmas tree needed more colors we added some more how do you like it <laughs> oh money okay fix it yeah we are santa art yes, yes. oh god <laughs> all right guys see sister santa here <laughs> guys it's monique and i must remember monique she's with me for the weekend and we out we're going out on the road and you know so we have to carry on everywhere we start the vlog already so we are just gonna add this to it so guys let me show you something mm. yep got my foot Put my jacket on there for me. Nice, Monique. I love the color. It's nice. Okay, guys. So, me and Sister Santa Claus going out. You know, she's ready for Christmas. Okay. So, we are going to go ride. Where are we going again, Nisi? Um, Raymore and Panagan. Raymore and Panagan. One furniture store, and I know so we have to carry on and show them everything we do because in our family. So start up the car and we have a drive and talk. Alright. Yeah. You know the way? Um, you put in your GPS. But remember, say so you have to go turn up here some for us. Yeah. Guys, we live in this place, this area, 20 something years. and. I still use my GPS to go certain places. Is that weird or what? My face look like it's a glow. Girl just beard and put on moisturizer and the bio oil. Eh. Yeah. <laughs> what, eight minutes, right? Eight minutes. It's not far from here. Guys, it looks bleaky. Wait, oh, we can't be heated. It's a good sound in that. You know that cool, you know? Yes, it's a good sound in that video. Sorry about the sound, guys. Let's turn up here, so. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, we are driving and talk to now a little bit. Nothing happened, don't worry. We just had chit chat. So, anyways, the car I just showed you guys, the one I'm in right now. It's Monique's car. Guys, I'm super, super, super proud of this girl. She come here, how long a year now, Mama? Like two years? Oh, uh, July, three years. July, three years. Guys, literally, she came into this country, her and her mommy and her brother, not even three good years yet. Two and a half. Oh, next year, July. Mm -hmm. So you just see two years this no, three. July gone, what's three years? The oh. Proceed to the route. The time I got so fast. So anyway. At the stop sign, turn left onto Daisy Drive. Then turn right onto Forest Avenue. Long story short, guys. No, don't turn right, turn left. Yeah. So, them just come here. And this girl, why I'm proud of her is because she, right she come here and she know what she want, right? She in our good job. She's going to school, going back to school. At the next stop sign. Turn and right. you think of a vlog with that attack? You can. You can. You're not gonna be too. At the stop sign, turn right onto Mount Laurel Road. The GPS won't stop that, guys. So let me make sure to talk. <laughs> I'm gonna know all now. Yeah, this is one good car. No? This morning, there were parked cars out there. Yeah, go straight. Straight? Yeah. So, anyways, guys, she just come here. She and her mother. And them work them butts up, then she had go back at school. See what she do now, guys? She bought her car. I'm so, right. 
we so proud of her because only well, people live here years before her not to compare her with anybody else especially young people when uh, first off don't know what they want don't put their money to good use waste their time don't go back to school or none of that she's doing all the above so I just want her to know how proud I am of her for achieving everything what she achieved because it's only up from here yep. not backward at the light turn right onto Prince Town Road then take a slight left turn on so guys I just wanted to share my joy with you show me my car so 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 so, so. Oh. sorry this is the slight left turn in the matter. Turn left onto Snyder Road. So yeah, when you reach up the light, you have to make the turn. Good girl, remember your driving school skills. Yeah. Come to a complete stop at your stop sign. Yeah, yeah guys. Yeah. But of course, you know she come here and got the license. If you get left out of the part there, she got driving school. Get our license now onto the car. Proud are really, really proud are. So now we don't do no whole heap of chatting, chatting. We are going to read more from it, and so be sure now when we get there. We have them up discount and free gift. I for... think we should have turned, shouldn't we have turned left? Where's the GPS in? I should have down there. Go straight. Yeah, right. yes, I mean. You know, so over there, some work, right? The day job. You see how close my work to house, to my house? So guys, I'm going to take you right through the store and show you everything that they do have in stock. They have a lot of like antique furniture. So if you like old fashioned looking stuff, they have a lot of those and a few modern time um, furniture. Way more stuff them is more old fashioned, but they're nice. And when you talk about good quality stuff, check this store. I have a bedroom set for over 14 years, them older than Kaylee. And I still have them, and the bed now, Mashapango, nowhere. It's still standing firm. Them stuff is a little bit pricey but good 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 quality me love that i personally love this table for monique but it's too big for the space that she wanna put it in Look at these nice decors. Look at them. Very unusual stuff them have, guys.
guys, one thing I do know about this store is that they carry a lot of beautiful sofas and love seats. Wow, this is nice. That's nice though. I love this section now. It's beautiful. Watch this neat little dining table, guys. This is more like for a single person. It's cute, right? I love this little accent chair right there. I would put it in my room. Look at it. Beautiful. I like this. Look at this nice little bedroom set and those pictures on the wall. They're priceless. They're beautiful, guys. Guys, how do you all feel about this diamond-shaped mirror? I love it. I've been looking for something to put over my, my sofa, but I'm not sure about the color.
almost everything was on sale today because it's customer appreciation day. So they had like, you know, percentage off and stuff like that. Good, good deals, guys. That yeah. it's kind of nice. So guys, if I do decide to get the mirror that I want to put over my sofa, it's going to be this one.
and guys they also do carry a lot of nice leather sets wow look at that fireplace guys you see that that's cute So guys, please make sure to comment down below and let me know if you enjoyed these kind of videos and let me know what was your favorite piece in this furniture store. I'm waiting guys, I'm going to be checking my comment section. Guys, take a look at this nice antique bedroom set. I love it. This is almost like the one I was telling you guys about that I have it for over 14 years. It's something almost like that one. Strength is not the word. It's the strongest bedroom set I've ever seen. Every year is to completely have shopping wrapped, done under the tree. You know when you're out and about and you're doing stuff. Guys, I love, love, love this one. Let me know what you all think. Look at this one from the side view, guys. Nice. So guys, I did end up purchasing a pair of these lamps. Um, they were on sale for $115 a piece. And I love them because of the, the golden finish. And I do decorate my house in a lot of gold decors.
so so far away see what you like for your mother Mm-hmm. Them two very nice. The dining here would have made it better. Okay. Not much over that side here. I don't like that. Them they're old fashioned. The one thing we can't tell you though. The more funny than stuff them is quality. These ancient, but them not done. Yeah, people say it. Go on this already. I'm supposed to be good. Mm -hmm. You can't lift them. Table them, take up too much space. It's like even mine in my living room. If me could have read over, I wouldn't get that shape table. Because it's too big, it take too much space. Yeah. Nice. When you're in the laptop, buy me this. <laughs> okay, guys. Me and Monique, we're done in the store. We had fun. So, I'm glad you came with us on the road. We're going to find something to eat now and go home. All right. See you later. <laughs>